Hi there. Hi there. I'm Jeremy, and this is the Not So Berry Challenge, a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have 10 generations of Sims, each themed after a different color. We've been working on the mint generation for a while, and Listerina made a clone of her best friend, Derek Pancakes. Oh, look. <gasps> Listerina is investigating the weird lights. She's getting abducted by aliens. I guess we'll see how that goes. Robin and Rusty are both asleep. K is asleep. Arturo here, why don't you play chess for a little while? Oh, and he was watching a movie about werewolves. All right, Listerina's back. Welcome back, Listerina. Yeah, go to bed. Let's fast forward through the rest of the night. Oh, today is games day. Sims just have to play games today. They can play board games, video games. Robin needs to wake up. He's having a toilet emergency. Arturo, why don't you make breakfast for everyone? K, you can wake up. Rusty is fine. Listerina's fine. K, let's have have you give some attention to the cat. Yeah, Peppermint needs some love. Yeah, we'll have everybody grab a plate. Everybody's down here at the same time. Arturo, get out of werewolf form because you're st kind of stressing out the cat. Oh, there you go. And they fixed this sink that you broke. Rusty's doing good, it looks like. Let's have Rusty go ahead and do his homework. Robin, do you have homework? You've already done yours. Okay, very good. Oh, Hey, Robin's got a good reputation and he became friends with another adult. All right, so now we just need to become friends with one more child. So let's invite Cyrus over. Listerina, why don't you work on your logic? Kay, why don't you come work on your programming for a little bit? Robin, come hang out with Cyrus. I'm just gonna spam interactions with Cyrus here. Play make-believe, talk about the best color. There we go, aspiration completed. Robin has completed his childhood dream of being very popular. He earned the socially gifted trait and he's going to build social skills faster now. Rusty, what are you doing? You're going to play with a toy? You want to play on a jungle gym while playful? I think a bubble bath will make you playful, won't it? Oh, and since Rusty is a loner, he's really happy to be doing his own thing right now. Here, Listerina, why don't you read your mischief book? Because you're really close to getting that next level of the mischief skill. Robin, keep hanging out with your friend. Kay is about to reach the next level of his programming skill. Oh, there we go. He reach level nine. Rusty is playful. Why don't you come play on this jungle gym? Oh, and there's a kid over here. Brenna Cortez. Robin can go introduce himself. Robin and Rusty are like, bye mom. We're going to play on the jungle gym. We'll just be right outside. Robin's got a loose tooth. Oh, he's having fun playing by himself. Look at this. Robin, why don't you wiggle that loose tooth? Okay, what are you doing? Were you just punching the blarfy? Yeah, go practice your speech in the mirror, dude. Robin, pull out your loose tooth. There we go. He, he's got his tooth out. Oh my God, look who it is. It's Ember Vega. She's in a bad mood. <laughs> All right, he's going home now. Hey, and Rusty played on the jungle gym long enough. We can have him stop. He achieved the first level of his uh, motor aspiration. Hey, why don't you come practice piano? Why don't you call Derek up and just have a chat with him, Listerina? Talk to him about his clone and be like, look, I didn't know that this clone was gonna be a part of my household. Can you take him in? Because I don't really know what to do with him. And Derek is like, no, he's your problem. All I agreed to was being cloned. I didn't agree to take anyone in. She's like, fine. I'll figure it out. Listerina's taking a nap. <laughs> She's got no energy. Robin, why don't you come play on the jungle gym for a little while? Or not jungle gym, monkey bars. Rusty, you can come play too. Listerina, you're feeling revived after your nap, it looks like. Rusty is going to bed, it looks like. Yeah, he's tired. It's only 8.13. We can let him get an early rest. That's fine. Robin, you can do the same thing and go to bed. Kay is feeling sad. Get yourself some leftovers. And Listerina, why don't you read your mischief book again? Kay's feeling a lot better now. He just needed a good meal. And then he can come and join Arturo playing chess. He can still do a little bit more gaming for games day. Finally, level eight of the mischief skill. Looks like Arturo is about to reach the next level of logic skill. Oh, he's already level nine. He's about to max the logic skill. Go off, Arturo. There it is. Reach logic level 10. Okay, go to bed. And Listerina, you can go to bed too. Arturo, what are you doing? You're dancing. Let's actually turn that off and then have you come and sleep on the floor. And everyone is asleep all at the same time. But well, today's going to be Rusty's first day of school. All right, it looks like it's time for these kids to start waking up. Robin has another loose tooth. He's already lost two. Listerina, go take care of yourself. That's fine. We got something else from the Tooth Fairy. Another poster. Oh, this one's different from the one we had before. We're getting all sorts of stuff from the Tooth Fairy. There we go. Everybody's getting food. Rusty's feeling good. Who wants to practice typing? There it is. Practice typing. 
Rusty is enjoying his alone time per usual. And Robin, today is your last day as a kid. You're going to age up into a teenager. You're going to go to school today. And then when you come home, we're going to have a birthday party for you. Speaking of which, the kids go to school in an hour. It feels like it's been forever since Listerina and Kay have been romantic. Well, here, let's fix that. They need to have a moment together. There we go. Oh, and they need to give gifts today. Do you have a holiday season gift? This rare gemstone. Kay, why don't you give a gift to her? You don't have anything. Let's purchase a gift from him for her real quick. Oh, and the kids have gone off to school. They got a sentiment from that. Aw. Festive lighting is today. So that means today is the day we have to put up the holiday tree. So why don't we go ahead and do that real quick? And let's go admire the lights. Counts towards the festive lights for the holiday. Arturo, why don't you get some leftovers? Kay and Listerina, you're both doing well. Oh, Kay's getting a phone call. Robin got sick and threw up in the hallway in front of a bunch of other students. He's with the nurse now. Should we make sure he doesn't get teased or should we do a thorough health check? Let's do the health check. Oh, and everyone seems to be talking about a birthday party that Rusty wasn't invited to. Well, Rusty doesn't know anyone. Should he ask his friend or let it go? I think he just let it go. Rusty's kind of a loner anyway. Who needs a friend like that anyway? Rusty tunes it out and plays with the new boy at recess. Kay, leave the Blarfy alone. All right, well, it's time to go to work with Listerina. What does she need to do? She needs to analyze a metal, mix a smart serum, and mind control co-workers to change outfits. Here, change into your sleepwear, Archer. There we go. It's pajama day at the office today. We need to mix a smart serum. Do we have what we need for that? We do. Let's go ahead and make one of those. Oh, and it looks like Janet Goody became an elder. Look at her. Well, there's Derek. He hasn't been at work in a while. Uh, we need to contact aliens. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Start a neighborhood hive mind. Let's uh, make everyone happy today. We'll do a happy town. Janet, let's have you change into your pajamas. There you go. Derek, let's put you in your pajamas too. All right, let's come analyze a metal next. Yeah, here we go. We can analyze the death metal. Calibrate an electroflux wormhole generator. Uh, okay, I have that in my inventory. Attempt alien contact. Okay, let's do that. Hey! alien came out. Who is this? Faith Case. Nice to meet you, Faith. Oh, look at that reptile tail she's got. That's really cool. I love this sim. All right, do I have what I need for a snake oil serum? I do. There we go. That was the end of the day. I knew she wasn't going to get promoted. We'll probably get it in the next video though. But we are home and it is Robin's birthday. We're going to go ahead and get started on all of the festivities. Okay, you can start out by making a cake. Why don't we make Robin a strawberry cake? Where is that? Listerina uh, you can come pay the bills. All right, Listerine is going to go look in the mirror for a little bit. I hate that she does that. Can I just make her quit the spotlight? I'm not really loving her being a celebrity. So we're going to quit the spotlight. We're going to do a birthday party. The birthday sim is, of course, Robin Wildberry. He's aging up to a teen. And we're going to do this at the house. Put birthday candles on this thing before anybody has a chance to interact with it. And then Robin, happy birthday, Robin! So the Rose generation is supposed to have three very specific traits. Those are hot-headed, snob, and romantic. I do have the more traits in cast mod installed, but I'm only going to use the three required traits and leave the other two blank for him. So I'm going to go ahead and give him this romantic trait right now, and we'll give him the snob trait when he ages up to an adult. The Rose generation's aspiration is the serial romantic aspiration. So let's go ahead and go into cast. I don't really hate how he's turned out. And this is a reminder for you all to upload some Sims to the gallery for Robin to meet at school. Use the hashtag NotSoJeremy to upload your teen Sims and their families, and I'll place a bunch of them in my game. I'll be downloading your Sims from the gallery in the next video when Robin starts high school. So I spent a long time on his outfits, and he has a bunch of them, but you know what? He deserves to look good. Everybody, meet Robin Wildberry and all of his teenage glory. I guess let's go ahead and age up his friends too. This is our aged up Emerson. This is our aged up Crystal. And Robin went to bed during his own party, but it's fine. He could do that. I might have to give some of these other sims makeovers uh but i do need to give robin's bedroom a makeover maybe this red computer here i think i want him to play guitar although he's not going to be the super athletic one that's going to be his brother rusty when he gets older let's put a punching bag in the backyard and also i think let's get a workout machine too robin wildberry is now a teen living in his teenage bedroom i'm gonna go ahead and end the birthday party since robin went to bed i'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here thank you so much for watching 
watching. I'll see you in the next video.